So tonight on the show, I want to make this video. So tonight I want to make this video. It's a, it's a little bit, it's a little bit different than what I usually do. Um, I w I'm going to talk about um, something I have not done in a long time. And that is, if you all, and that is, I am tonight, I am going to talk about the WWE. Now, I used to talk a lot, a, a, about the WWE a lot when, you know, the channel first came, uh, you know, I started doing the chat, the, the show, um, you know, back in 2015, you know. And then, you know, I stopped because now, I don't know how the views would be now because um, that was, like I said, two years ago when I had about, you know, 15 subscribers. Now I have like almost 110, so it might get a little bit more views now, I don't know. But I have not talked about WWE in like two years now. Um, I was supposed to do a WrestleMania show, but then I forgot, or I, I didn't have time or whatever. Um, but tonight I'm gonna talk about the WWE for the first time like in, in a while. And what I'm gonna say is, it does not have to do anything with the shows. It has to do something with like, something else. So here we go. Okay, so Vince McMahon, the person that the 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 the, the, um, the person that runs WWE, is thinking of is thinking is thinking of selling the WWE. He's thinking of selling the WWE because he wants to get his own football league. So he wants to sell the WWE and wants to get his, his own football league. Remember, I don't know if you guys know, about 15 years ago, he tried doing this. Um, he tried having his own football league. It only lasted like one year, and then they went. They, they, it was terrible, terrible. Um, nobody watched the games. Nobody cared. It was terrible. I was too little. I don't remember too much of it. I remember hearing about it when I would watch wrestling. They would like talk about it, but I don't think I ever watched the game. Um, so this man is thinking of selling his his WWE that kind of sucks nowadays, you know. And he's thinking it of making his own football league. What? <laughs> this this Vince McMahon guy. I don't understand him lately. He used to be so smart when he like when I was a little man, you know, when I was the, the little man. He I, he used to be so smart, and now I don't know what the hell has happened to him. He's such a. Uh, He's so soft nowadays. He 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 does the stupidest things, you know. He he doesn't even allow them to like. He's just so stupid now. He's like so like Disney Channel. Like what the hell? Like I feel like I'm watching Disney Channel sometimes. He's so stupid lately, and like he he the WWE may go out of business soon. To be honest, so that's supposed to be his his um. His, um, his, um, his thing, the WWE, it's like my thing, my thing to, my thing to go, to talk about sports, right? So imagine if I say, you know what, the sports are, the sports are done, I'm no longer talking about sports, now I am going to talk about, um, I want, I want, I want, I'm gonna talk about. I, I'm I, now. I'm gonna talk about. What the hell? Um. What the hell? I want to talk about. Um. I cannot think of anything right now. I. I oh man. I want to talk about. You know. I want to. I want to be a model. You know. I want to be a man model. That's kind of gay. Anyways, I want to be a man model. You know. Maybe I want to. You know. Maybe I want to be a. Uh, president, maybe I want to be. I don't know. I cannot. I don't know why I'm having trouble just thinking of next. Uh, of, uh, anyway, whatever. So I quit sports because today I am here to announce I am quitting sports. I I will now be a. I I I I, I will now be a, a a teacher. There we go. You're so stupid, see. Toot, you're so stupid. Anyway, I'm gonna be a teacher now. I'm gonna go get my Harry Potter glasses. I'm gonna go to the dentist. Pull my teeth out. Look like a Bugs Bunny. Um, you know, wear, a, wear a, a sweater, you know, a nerd, a vest, a, a sweater, you know, wear my, um, poo pants, you know, the ones that look like you shit on them, you know, the shit color ones, or the black ones, um, yeah, don't ever get sh well, unless you fucking have diarrhea problems, do not ever get those, 
What are those pants called? The the the, the ones that jo Jim Jim Harbaugh used to, wears. Um, the shit color pants, you know, or black pants, you know. And I'm gonna be a teacher. I guys, I have no clue. I'm an idiot. Okay, I I was in special ed for like. From like elementary school until senior high school, my you know my family did you know they cannot believe I actually got through. They were crying. They cannot believe it. They were like, "What the hell? He actually did it." I was an idiot, you know. And I saw all of a sudden I want to be a teacher. What do you think people are gonna say to me, son, Mexican, CE, you, you, what the hell's wrong with you? You could barely get by school. You're struggling with your show. You're only getting like, well, I'm not, well, okay, whatever. Maybe I'm struggling to some people. I feel like I'm getting better. But you're, you're barely getting on your sports show. What makes you think now you're going to be on teacher? You stupid ass. You barely got past high school. You know? What is wrong with this man? What is wrong with this man? Is this guy like, does this guy need to be, is this guy a marijuana? The guy is having the last 10 years, the, sh the WWE has sucked. It really has. I watch, I watch it every night. Monday, Tuesday. Well, I don't, you know, I, I watch it when I have time. I don't, I'm obviously watching the football game or whatever's on. But when I have time, you know, when I have two, three hours, I'm like, all right, let's watch WWE, what happened. I watch, you know, Monday show. I watch Tuesday show whenever the hell I have time. To be honest, Tuesday show sucks ass, by the way. Um, but this man is no longer that he, he can, he, I think the WWE is going to go out of business soon, to be honest, if he does, at least I think one of their shows can go, like they do two shows a week, I think one will go out of business soon, I think they may have to do that because they, they, they're talking about how they don't have time to write the show, what the hell, so they're like, oh, oh you know, we, we don't, we wish we had more time to write our show, you know, we have to like, we only have like, we have to, we have to get in on the, in the morning and we have to literally make up the show by 7 o'clock so we can go on TV. I'm like, dude, what the, because, uh, how do you not have your show ready? You have a week. Or, well, okay, okay, you can literally start, like, writing the shows, like, fucking the day after the show. Like, you have an entire week. Yeah, you know, well, we do, they, they do these, um, we do these, um, house shows over the weekend. Yeah, those shows don't matter. They're on TV. They're a piece of shit. Nobody wa They're not on TV. They're a piece of shit. Nobody watches them. Focus on the TV shows. You have these writing teams. And why that? They don't have to be on the, on the fucking weekend shows. Have them go, have them, have them sit somewhere, you know, from Tuesday to fucking... Sunday, I don't know, and have them all work as a team to write the damn show. So when it comes to Monday, here you go. This is your part. This is your part. This is your part. This is your part. Literally, they show up on Mondays. Nobody knows what the hell they're doing. They interview the wrestlers. They interview the wrestlers on, in, in the mornings on 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 on, on 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 and they interview them like, okay, so tonight here in New York, um, WWE event tonight at seven o'clock from. You know, from whatever, the, call, the, the, the Staples Center, whatever, or, well, Los Angeles, and the Staples Center. And they ask them, what are we going to see tonight? And the guys literally sit there, we don't know, when we get to the arena, we'll find out. I'm like, what? They literally don't know what the hell they're going to do. They show up, in a few hours they figure out what they're going to do. Like, and this man, he's so bad organized with the WWE. What makes him think he's going to be able to run a football company? You don't even know anything about football. Like, I'm sure he doesn't. I'm sure he doesn't know anything about football. <sighs> what is wrong with this man? I get it, you might want to sell the WWE and do nothing and just enjoy your life, your money, you know, for the future, maybe the money for your family. Okay, but why sell the WWE if you're already kind of failing on it the last 10 years to go work in a football company where you're gonna die? You're not going to be able to compete with the NFL at all. I'm telling you right now. Especially when you already tried it 15 years ago and you fell flat on your face. I cannot believe this man. What is wrong with him? Why would you do that to yourself? If you were failing the WWE, once you were amazing, now it sucks. Maybe you should just retire, sell the company, and you're going to get a lot of money for it, even though it sucks. You're still going to get a lot of money for it. 
Enjoy your money. Maybe have a new, maybe open up a taco restaurant, you know? I don't know. Or maybe, I don't know. Do something. You don't have to do anything. You're going to get enough money where your whole family's going to be able to set their house and, you know, you know, just fucking do nothing all day. Watch TV. This guy is actually putting his money on the line. The money he sells from the WWE on the line by trying to get his own football league. It's not going to work. I am telling you right now. It did not work 15 years ago. What makes you think it's going to work now? And the WWE was in a much better place 15 years ago. Now the WWE is sucking ass. It really is. Um, they, they have no stars. They really don't. They, 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 they're still having guys like the Triple H and The Undertaker, Kane, Still wrestle why because they don't they don't have they don't have starts they have not created stars I don't know what the hell has happened in the last ten years they don't know what to do anymore they they suck I still watch the shows because I bet it's like part of my life but I'm telling you right now if you have not watched WWE since like 2007 or even more it sucks now it really does um but what makes this man think that what would who makes what thing that you're you're gonna fail on something you're supposed to, like I said, okay, I'm doing, you know, you're supposed to be so amazing at, at, at WWE, and now the last two years you really fail, what makes you think, okay, now throw this away, sell this, and now let's go a football league where you have no idea what the hell you're doing. So let's say this, right now, my CD show, all right, well, I wish I had like 1,000 followers, I only have 100 and whatever, 7, whatever it is. So I'm going to stop doing sports, and I'm going to try to become... A, 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 a math teacher and I'm gonna teach all of you math uh, uh, algebra on, on, on the show so instead of the C sports show it's gonna be the CE Albert Einstein ma math sh show so ladies and gentlemen let's look here what is what the fuck where the fuck anyways who cares ladies and gentlemen what is 1 times act e times A W A K Y S F Y can somebody tell me the answer? Put it in the comment section. You know, um, little, um, little Tommy, can you, little Timothy, can you please tell me this? I have decided to stop doing sports talk and move over to being the next Albert Einstein. So let me do algebra. So 1 plus x1 n1 to wf xy plus 3x789. Little Timmy, can you tell Marty? Can you tell me what that was equal? Marty's probably drunk. Anyways, um, I'm sorry. Anyway, <laughs> anyways, um, can you tell me what that is? Nobody, what the, you guys, what are you guys tell me? Say, e, are you smoking marijuana? I don't even know if I can say that. Anyways, you, you would think I'm, you know, see, like, it's so stupid. It really is. I hope this not to happen. Now, they're saying that he may not sell the WWE and still do the football league. They're also saying that, that he may just not sell and do that same thing as he did 15 years ago. Have the WWE, have the football league. But then, you, then what, he's using the money from the WWE to the football league. That, the WWE is already falling flat on his face. It's just going to be worse if you start using the money from the WWE to do your own football league. I really don't understand that. Oh, shit, I almost... I, I really don't understand this at all. I, I, I just, literally, if, if you're tired of the WWE, sell it and don't do anything. Just don't do anything. I know there's people that just don't want to let go and want to do something. All right, dude. You're 71 years old. Just let it go. Let it go. Let the WWE go and just do nothing. It's okay. You're 71 years old. Just sit in your house. Do nothing. Maybe play, I don't know, go out for a coffee or something. I don't know. At this, you know, you, it's okay if you don't do anything. You're 71. You don't have to. If you lost a passion for the WWE, sell it. And then just do nothing. You don't, just because you lose the passion at age 71, does not mean you have to start a football league or a fucking, um, hot, hot cheeseburger eating contest. You know, that's what, what I should do. Anyways, um... It is so stupid to me. It really is. I hope this is not true at all. Um, this cannot be true at all. This is true. It's all for the WWE. It really is. Um, I do not know what the hell would happen if it was a company. If they ever, if that ever happens, we will hear, stay here and talk about it. Because maybe that needs to happen too. Just, ha like, that's another topic. The WWE getting sold. You know, because... 
I, I don't know. I think it's because his kids had kids, and they're thinking about how they how they would feel if their their kids watch WWE and all that violent stuff. So that's why they decided to go soft on us. And my father always used to tell me, you know, my father, you know, son, you shouldn't really watch this. This is this is too physical for you. You know, you should you should do your homework. You know, you should watch the news. You should fucking you know, play chess, or, you know, you should be, you know, don't watch this. He would always tell me, I didn't care, I would just watch it. I was a W, I've been a WWE fan since 1997, I believe. Okay, OCE, oh, you're retired, you're so old. <laughs> anyway, shut up. Anyways, um, I, I believe around 97 I used to watch WWE. So, I've been a fan, it's part of my life, even though it sucks, I'm still watching it, you know. But yeah, it really sucks, and it may be better for them to sell the company. That's a thought that you forget about the whole football league with Vince McMahon. Just sell the company, or at least have Vince McMahon leave and have Triple H, who's the the what do you call it, the son-in-law, but with a younger a younger person, maybe he can run the company. Sometimes that happens too. You get to a certain age, and you know, you get soft. It happens. Um, so maybe bring in a, a, a 40, 50, 50 years, I believe this man is. Have him run the company with a fresher mind. More of a, he's still 50, kind of old, but not at 71. Have more ideas. Anyways, I just think it's stupid. I just think it's stupid. I just think it's super stupid. I, I'm all, I'm all, I'm all right with them selling the company if they just don't feel like it's going anywhere. Have them take their money, leave, enjoy their lives, whatever. But for them to do a football league when they already failed in it 15 years ago, what makes you think that you're going to succeed now? Like, who the hell is going to watch this WWE football over... And who the hell, where the hell do you get the players from? Well, I guess you can get some players that don't get make it to the NFL. Yeah, I guess you can do that. And then, you know, like in, in the minor leagues, you know, there's a lot of players who suck ass and they never make it to the major leagues. And they play for a, for a little money, you know, and they just want to play base, you know, they just want to play and they just play, you know, for like, literally, I, I went to a minor league stadium when it's more like shit and my, and, and, and they told me, well, that's their passion. They rather, you know, play like this, earn like fucking $7 a day and, you know, live in the shit than fucking have a normal job. Some people are like that. So maybe if somebody doesn't make it to the NFL and they just love to play football as their passion, Maybe you can say, okay, that's where you can get the players from. Have those shitty ass players that they didn't make it, you know. Maybe players instead of having to go to Canada, you know, they can just, you know, because that's, that's like, or arena football, which that's fucking stupid anyways. You know, have the, go to the fucking WWE wrestling company, I mean, the WWE football company. I don't know. We'll see where that happens. I mean, I think there's a way to get the players. You know, there's a lot of players who want to play football who do not make it to the NFL. So I think that I actually don't think that I think that would be a problem to be honest. I think there's a lot of football players out there that do not make the NFL who want to play football, and so they would they you rather play football here than have to go to the C, than they have to go to Canada or have or the XFL was as funny as it like 50, 50 yards kind of sad. That shit's stupid. So I don't think that would be a problem. I just think the problem is do you get people to watch it? You know how do you get people to watch it? But anyways, if that happens, we'll come up with how you can get people to watch it. But anyways, I'm out. I'm out. I'm out. I'm out. Um, Friday show only had... I, I'm not... I, I don't know. Friday show. Uh, I, I see that it went like 27 minutes. Very long. And only has like 12 views. Is that serious about to go... I, I don't know. I'm thinking about it. Let me know in the com let me know in the comment section what you guys if you guys want me to end, um, finish that series. I feel like it's coming to an end. I, I look at it 27 minutes too long, only 12 views. <sighs> maybe we should end that series. Let me know in the comment section and maybe if you guys have anything to say to me, I'll just answer it. You know the when the so if you ask me something today like, hey C E um, Lakers, what do you think about the Lakers right now? Out, like at the end of the at the end of that day show, I'll be like, oh hey, um, Marty asked me this, and so I will answer. Maybe we can do that instead. You know, I don't know. I mean, I want to try to answer your questions. Like I, I hate typing. Like I just told you I was terrible in school. So if you guys move and do that, the day you guys ask me, 
maybe I can just be at the end of the show. At the end of the show, I can when the topic's over, I can just be, hey, Marty today asked me, he has, you know, um, what do I think about the Lakers? They won versus the Celtics. What do I think about this? And that can just be, and then I can just answer the question after the show. You guys, let me know. It's your, you guys have your thoughts, and let me know. Um, I want to thank everybody for joining me tonight on the C show. Um, but yeah, I was thinking, I'm like, 27 minutes, only 12 views. Might have to end that series soon. Let me know. I don't even think we have a quote. We may have one, I think. We need at least five, so. Let me know. Anyways, ladies and gentlemen, until next time, I want to thank, you know, thank you for joining me. And until next time, I will see you later. Oh, mother. Oh, let's see here. Oh my god! Oh yeah! Oh, I thought I did not. I thought I did not play. I thought I did not press play. I was gonna say mother. Ch I was gonna say, are you kidding me? All that performance for nothing. All, all that performance for nothing. Anyways, look at the show's over. Thank everyone for joining me. Until next time, I will see you. Later.